Hello and welcome to Hair Tips with a Smile. This is the first of its kind for me. And this is 1968 with me in the center there and laughing at myself here, 2016. I am going to help us Nana's old school blending with the new school. Here I am with a mirror and my hair the way it is today. My old school little knots and this is how it turns out. Nothing fancy. Voila. And I like to change up. I like to just get up, shake my hair, and go. It's a co-wash. I have a 4C pattern. And I know you're laughing by now at the quality of this video, but it's my first. Bobby pins, yes, I still use them. Pin curls, wrap my hair really cute, go out, come back. The next day I have a style. Did you know you can use hair pins for a latch hook? Yes. And my hair has grown a lot. It's maybe about three, four inches. I used to wear it really close, but the gray hair, I'm having a challenge with it to keep it shiny and, and, and moisturized. It does its own thing. So get a friend and kind of work it out the best way you know how. Now, I like to keep my white hair popping with shimmer lights and I have to wash more often to keep it from turning yellow but for the most part I like to co-wash but I wet my hair or rinse my hair every day water 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 keep it handy that's one thing that's good I use the castor oil right here the Jamaican black castor oil on my skin my face my neck my edges and I use Sister Lock Care products or whatever works for you for moisturizer. And I like that fresh spray to keep it fresh. Um, because sometimes, you know, your hair with the buildup can get an odor to it. Shine and wet, I still use that. Those are old school. And you see how white my hair is? You cannot put anything with color on your hair. Eco Style Gel and a Bristle Brush is my friend. I do like to wear my hair smoothed back for a change. I don't like to wear my hair the same all the time. Um, I love that. And this style takes a lot of gel. Um, a blow dryer is your friend. You can get one from a thrift store. It doesn't have to be anything fancy. But my diffuser is a cap. And it keeps your hair from moving and dries it. So welcome to my world and my big hair, which... I don't know why I did this. This is a DIY. Take a glass case, uh, eyeglass case, fill it up with some of your quickie products. If you're going to go run someplace or whatever, throw that in your bag. So that is a good way to recycle some of your old glass cases. And you can label them. I'm the smile lady, so I put a smile on mine. Bands are great. They are really great for holding your hair or styling your hair in a bun. Or whatever and again a hairpin could be a latch hook in a pinch so or you can clip it in certain spots where you know you want some enhancement you can clip it into a pin curl and there's a latch hook and a comb which you kind of need if you're gonna add in hair and some people call it crochet clamps are good to hold your hair while styling and picks used to lift your hair I used to wear it on the back of my head in the day. Here I am, on natural castor oil and a satin cap infused with coconut oil. And I lay my edges down with a toothbrush. Now, this is my favorite type of hair because it's really kinky. And I love it because that B44 matches my hair almost perfectly. This is a style I use. Um, this is the latch hook or crochet. And then I twist it into little knots. Um, in a future video when I get bold I will do a tutorial live you know online but this is me now this is the latch hook and also a wig I rock my wigs I wear it new and I trim it and then I let it get old and it looks more like my hair I do not throw them away and it's 40 bucks for a hairstyle that's 40 bucks a year you know for a wig it lasts about a year um, and what you just saw was I used wraps. Now here's the old school curlers. Paper bag, twist it up. You can make about 15 or 20 of them. 
roll your hair damp, not really wet, let it dry, and if you have to go out and run, wrap a scarf around it. And it comes out really curly. Now this was only in about two or three minutes, and that's how much it curled. But uh, you don't have to buy a lot of stuff, you know. Um, this is a bra strap, and I use this when my hair is wet and I want to hold my hair back is better than pulling something over your head. You can just unclip it. This sponge I use when my hair is really short. I don't like using it now at this length. And again, I do wrap my hair satin cap. Moisture helps keep the moisture in, prevents breakage. But I don't like to sleep with anything on my head to tell you the truth. But this is an option. Okay, there I go with my natural hair and it is it uh, one of my transition styles with corn rolls about eight or twelve of them pulled back this is just nothing on my hair but a, a leave-in conditioner and a shake um, this is me laughing at myself doing this video <laughs> and a rose is a rose you know thorns and all you see my logic in the in the background but basically you want to do what's good for your hair now, in this particular clip, I'm about to go to get my hair cleaned up and trimmed at my daughter's salon. Um, she's now at Tiffany Nicole Loves, t and in Austin, and um, her, I let her and the Clipper Beast really do my hair. And um, I don't even know why at 60 plus I'm trying to grow my hair. There's my baby on the cover, but there's the Clipper Beast. He has his own place there in Texas also. I'm in California and when I go visit once a year or twice a year, that's how I get my hair cleaned up. So Clipper Beast did this for me last year. Um, trimmed it out a little bit. Of course, I was, I've been clipping a little bit. This is a latch hook and a, a shake. This is my natural hair after a shake and it shrinks up. That's why I say I have a 4C because it shrinks up a lot and my hair, especially the gray, takes so much moisture. I, I can't keep it moist enough. And um, so, so really, my tip, and stay tuned, it will be um, hair tips with a smile or hair tips with nail, old school and new school, I keep my hair and keep from being bored. I do not like to keep my hair the same. And I think my daughter, Tiffany Nicole Loves, gets that honestly. So anyway, stay tuned. Thank you so much for listening to me this nine minutes of hair tips with a smile. Yes, and they will get better. You can laugh. I'm laughing at myself. So anyway, see you, and thank you so much for smiling. Enjoy the music. I think this is really a music video, <laughs> as opposed to anything else. And if you got something out of it, let me know. Of course, I'm going to polish this up. I'm going to just really come out with single tips, and you will enjoy it. So Clipper Beast, go support that barber there in Texas. And also Tiffany Nicole Loves. I'm going to probably feature her. She has been doing hair since she was about 13 years old in my kitchen, my living room.